good morning and welcome to um, Assassin's Creed Origins and today I will um, be continuing to um, solve the puzzles of the papyrus. Um, I just wanted to basically um, touch base on the last episode that I did uh, which is where I was here getting the papyrus scroll from here. So basically um, you essentially, if you get your horse, um, you need to actually kind of go in this direction. Um, now, one of the things I did discover while doing this is it is very crucial in the part that you you stand so you have to kind of be in line with this view but at the same time you kind of need to also be sort of between this view as well um, and basically what I ended up having to do so what I'll do is I'll show you exactly what I did. Um, oh. Oh, it's just an hallucination. Um, so. This is the reason why you need to be in a certain position because the actual treasure is around about here in this um, sort of morning, what's it? So if you look at the way that sand is there, so if you're standing roughly about there and you see that there, um, basically that the tree bit where I'm standing, there should be like a crossway there and that is where the papyrus puzzle is. So you just need to bear in mind, you need to do that on the sunrise. Okay, so. Um, so you have the stables papyrus. So if you probably remember, you get this from Alexandria. Um, not far from the Hippodrome, which is just here. Um, so again, you're going to need to really bear with me because obviously I have to um, use the uh, actual clues from Google and have to work it out from that as to where it is. So. Um, now, I think this one here actually is in Latopolis, I think, so, um, Temple of Horus, which I think is Latopolis, um, let me, sorry, just let me just read the, right, so, yeah, so if we pass travel to there, So, I should just apologise, I had plans to do what was left of the papyrus solving um, on Monday, uh, Tuesday, Wednesday, if I hadn't completed it, um, and hoped to start the Curse of the Pharaohs on Saturday. Um, unfortunately, due to work and the hot weather, those plans never panned out. Um, and unfortunately, due to um right, so now that we're here, I mean, the thing is, is that it, you will find it is helpful. Um, so Ned Marius, then. Oh. Oh. Um, 
Penet Nebet, Penen de Jeruets, Semeru Nusetepsa, Ah, Sen, Herges, Yamentia. Right, I just tagged. Okay, I did tag the area, so why is it not showing up? Oh, there it is. I probably could have just ran that to be honest. Oh, hefty ang. Right, so <laughs> in this location, um, right, so um, a second. So we need to go over this way. Um, oh, there we go. Joseph's pride. Hmm, interesting. Um, let's have a quick look at Joseph's pride. Um, exactly. Oh, it's actually a better shield by the looks of it. Um, sleep on block. Um, oh, this was, I think, I believe this was the actual prize that we got for last. Um, what's it? So, uh, so uh, you know what? Let's put Joseph's pride on. Have something a little different, shall we? Right, so the bow of bra. Right, so what you're seeing here is basically uh, things that we picked up um, from the previous papyrus solving. Um, looks like these ones were not particularly great ones, so. Right, so. We're not doing too bad. Hopefully, we might be able to get these all finished today. Um, so, kind of say a hope sort of thing. Um, right, so. say for sure where I remember getting the deafening silence papyrus um, it is a strong possibility we got it from here uh, from the Serapium but I've got a feeling I think I already solved that puzzle to be fair um, uh, oh actually no um, from what I'm reading on the Google it is from the Serapium Um, right, so in this instance, I th think we've got to go back to Alexandria and we go actually go into here, to this island here. Um, so, uh, hang on a second, it would help if I actually travel to the location. 
So uh, I think I'm probably going to need to probably find a boat. I'm not sure I like the idea of swimming. Well, actually, I don't know, because it's quite clean, clear water there, and I don't think there's actually a lot of crocodiles within that area, because it is on the Mediterranean. Okay, so, um, Get out of the way. I'm kind of waiting to see if he would attack, but he wasn't interested. Right, so, um, Still doing the play by looks of it, look. <laughs> oh, sorry. Um, you know, if you've actually played through this game, you know that Thanos and that were going to do a play about um, uh, Ptolemy. Um, so the fact that they've done it. Um, oh. Sorry, child. Right, so I'm going to have to swim. Headed to Thebes? Mine is the fastest barge on the Nile. Oh, uh, it's because he's asking about the, um... Because obviously, um, that's for the curse of the fairies. The gods love a generous soul. Right, I am presuming he's speaking Greek. Um, right, so um, now it's a case of figuring out. area I keep pressing the wrong button to go up, but I am. Okay, so I don't.
let's go back because I think that I am kind of on the wrong side here. This is what I'm confused about. Right, okay, so let's go from the angle. Oh, there it is! <laughs> Another Joseph's Pride. Okay, um, looks like almost like a waste of time, personally. Um, but I think we can... Probably dismantle one of those. Um, or sell it, actually. Um, some money will be used for the, for the, the curse of the pharaohs, that's for sure. Um, Right, so the next one we are looking at is um, Temple of Sobek. Um, so, um, Temple of Sobek, I think that is cement this. Uh, it's the Temple of Tar. Uh, is this the one that's the um, Palace of Ypres? Where is the Temple of Tar? Forgotten now. Um, I mean, stay back. Right, well I did want to show you um, on the map where the Temple of Sobek was and I actually think now it is somewhere actually further up. Um, hang on, what's this? Um, no, I don't think it's that one. Um, I mean, naturally it would be understandable it would be in... but seen as Sobek seems to be predominantly up in this area. I think it's actually where we found Tahira. Um, so I think it's um, I'm pretty sure it's kind of around this area somewhere where we found Tahira. Um, is this it here? Um, it's Galanos's house. So uh, anyway, um, once you have it uh, you, or you've collected it, you'll—I mean—you'll already know what, what location it'll be from. Um, so, um, oh, hang on. Um, I think I might actually remember now. I think it's actually within the Latopolis area itself somewhere. Um, oh, hang on, I think I, um, where did, um, I can't remember now where, it's basically where we went to the arena um, for, oh, the Fayoum, the Fayoum, the Fayoum, yes, that's it. Sorry. <laughs> uh, 
Um, so it's where we went to the Fayum. I should have remembered the Templar Sobek was in the Fayum. Um, so uh, there's the arena. So this is basically the Temple of Sobek. Um, sorry about that. Um, so I mean, essentially, if you're doing this kind of afterwards and you don't remember where these locations are, um, uh, you can, ho I hope, refer to these. Um, uh, but in most cases, you will have found the actual papyrus along the way, um, because if you actually do have do the animus it does actually show you the location of it within um, if you when you go to the actual temple or the location where it's meant to be um, Right, so this one um, is actually saying we need to go think, um, Yes, so yes, I think we need to go here um, I think, I mean I think pretty much in some cases the papyrus um, riddles are not generally too far away from where you will find them. Right, so you do need to kind of bear in mind that there are 25 papyruses. Um, and I think that does actually um, kind of include, um, well I think when I counted it, it included um, Let me no 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 go go down. It's because I'm doing it from a different angle. Um, oh, I need to um see that thing. Right before I go any further, let me just untag um that Latopolis thing. Um, where, right, where's the Topolis again? Oh, actually, no, it was up here, wasn't it? Oh. Right, okay, so. <coughs> see, I think we've been here before already. Um, Definitely, it was it because this is where we had to jump into the bit with. Um, so that's the bit where we go in to do one of the. Um, because this is the um, tomb of Censoret. Oh, there we go. Kind of expecting to go to into the water. Um, 
it's quite weird because um, just now before I started recording, or about 25 minutes ago when I started recording, um, uh, I, I actually thought, um, Right, um, you, know, actually, you can actually hear um, uh, by X heart beating. Right, so the next one I on the list to do is the Valley Market. Um, so that is just there. So that is, you know, in terms of the map, it's just not far from Crocodilopolis. Um, Uh, so, um, and that was quite hard to find, um, but if you've actually followed what I was doing, you'll see how I found that. Um, but, um, hint, Ra is the sun god. Well, um, I know that I know that Ra is the sun god. He is initially the creator god. Um, it looks like what I can see here of the of the map. It looks like we're already in the location. Um, so basically we're going back to where we just did that one just now. Um, so let me just go back. because having now looked at it I could have just literally right so I think where that photo is which might actually give us a clue is where we actually need to go I think yes I think from the photo I'm looking at it looks like that's where we need to go so I think he's actually provided the clue there for us Yeah, so this is the tomb, um... <coughs> I think it was a sensor at the second. Right, uh, I think it might be worth calling in, um, the hammer of the tar. Literally just neighed right over what I just said. <laughs> okay, so this is actually sort of near. I think these are actually, because these look like pyramid burials. Um, <coughs> all right, from the photo I'm looking at, this. quite sure this, this is the position that I'm meant to be in from what I'm looking at but um, 
Oh, okay. Um, I actually went by. So I actually, I think, because as I said, that guy's photo actually gave us the clue to this one. Oh, there we go. It did. <laughs> so basically, thanks to that um, guy's photo, it gave us clues to where the location of that one was. Um, the little mini pyramids um, in which people, as far as I'm aware, were buried in. Um, <laughs> But I actually thought the the ones that I'm aware of were actually in Nubia, um, so it's a little surprising these are actually in Egypt. But to the ancient Egyptians, this would be consecrated ground. Oh, there's actually somebody here. Right. Okay. So. Um, Let's just stand here for a minute while I try and figure out the next one. Right, so um, the next one on the list is the Temple of Tah, which we know is in Memphis. Uh, I don't know why I keep saying Tah, you know, because so, the English they just say Tah, uh, which is kind of ironic actually, because we just say Tah. When we're saying th as an act, uh, th another form of um, thank you, um, and yet it's they're saying it's pronounced the same way for the ancient Egyptian god Tar. <laughs> um, so that isn't really that difficult to really ma say, really, if we're going to think about it. Anyway, but this is where the Temple of Tar is, which is in Memphis. It is not far from uh, what well, it is, not far from the actual Hidden Ones Bureau. Um, and obviously, I think as I've mentioned before, it makes sense that um, they went to Memphis and to be somewhere near the Temple of Tar because Pasharenta, uh, who is the high priest of the temple, um, is actually a founder of the Brotherhood. And um, I probably suspect, although they haven't said it in so many ways, that he does remain a member of the Hidden Ones. But I would imagine he would remain uh, a member of the Hidden Ones in a religious capacity, you know, so he would oversee that they went into the Duat um, before um, they went onto the Field of Reeds. So, you know, that would make sense. Um, it would have been nice to found out as well if um, they, you know, Tim Hotep, um, Pastor and Tal's wife, had actually had the baby, something we don't actually find out in the main story um so i'm just wrapping away on it what's it about different things that have happened in the main story um but i suppose it's because it's kind of trying to touch base on different things um that have happened but um i mean you'll see from that more or less the location that again you know you will see uh, you will see if you go through my walkthrough of what I've done, how I discovered that. But again, if you find it difficult, then just press the animus pulse and in the temple and it will actually indicate to you where it is now. Ironically, this is another one that isn't that far and it looks like it's somewhere about here. Let's go to Memphis. I think you'll find, you know, that um, if you want to do the puzzles after you've played the game, um, which I'm finding it a lot easier, you're less likely to be attacked while you're doing it. Um, so I've kind of noticed while doing the papyrus puzzles that. Uh, None of the Greek soldiers have attempted to attack me in any way, shape or form. Um, neither have the Romans. Right, so... Um Oh, sorry, mate. 
I don't know there's a boat there, but it's cool. Right, so, um, it looks like we're going to somewhere connected with these two bits here. So, um... I think it, yeah, I think it's this one here. Um... So, looks like we're actually so somewhere. Oh, okay. Hang on. Um, I think I kind of get in the picture now. Unfortunately, you can't really. Oh, there. Okay. Is that it already? Oh. Okay, so that was easy to find. It's pretty much just by the statue of Tar, which is probably one that collapsed in there previously. That was a good sense of judgment. Okay, mate, you don't need to worry. Right, so, um, now, of course, naturally, if you're going to do this while you're do, um, doing the actual gameplay, <coughs> um, then, um, would you know um, certainly you would probably find some treasures and I think there is actually some treasures in that location so I don't understand why I didn't come across it while I was swimming around at that point but never mind okay Right. I, I don't actually know why I bothered to I do not that. Be seen in this area. Oh, we're at the Memphis Barracks. Okay. Um, I really don't care because I really don't think you're really going to get caught now anyway. Um, right, so the Temple of Thoth. Um, now... Where was the Temple of Thoth? I've forgotten where that one is now. So this map is so... It is so large, to be perfectly honest. Um, if I remember rightly, I think the Temple of Thoth is somewhere...
I don't think it was anywhere near there. Um, is this where the Temple of Thoth was? No. Um, right, where was the Temple of Thoth? Come on, Gordon, remember where it was. Um, right, I've just given away my... Um. Oh. <coughs> Pretty sure it's in one of like the Greek carriers. Um. I remember it was somewhere near a mountain area, which is why I thought, because I know that is, I know, is a temple there, but I don't think it is the Temple of Thoth. I think it's um, the Temple of Khonsu. Um, I know it is near a mountain range. Um, I think we've actually solved this one already, so I don't. Um. I don't know why I keep going back to near Polidorus' estate because I don't remember it being there. But as I say, I'm pretty sure it is in. It has to be within the Men. This is what I don't get. It should be within the Menthis area because. Um, It would naturally, was it as you know, as you're progressing through, that would be the next stop you would go to. And from what I can see of it, it is somewhere, judging by the photo, within the Nile bit itself. Um, so. Why can I not? Oh, hang on, here we go, here we go. Right, so this is the Temple of uh, Thoth. Um, so it's here basically in this location at the, pretty much the bottom. So I was right, it would have been kind of on the way. Um, I feel like I've just wasted about two minutes of time then. Um, just for that, um, but then I'm also just trying to waste time. I think thinking about how I'm going to solve this from the. Um, I don't think I don't remember the one in the Temple of Thoth being that hard to find. Actually, I think it, if I remember rightly, it is just in front of the statue of Thoth. Um, right, so. Hermiopolis was the clue, southeast of the city of Hermiopolis, a leopard's den in the UA Bay Nome. Okay, so that is pretty. So 
So I think what it's saying is, is that Actually, not that far from it. Um, oh, okay. I um, right. I think I've gathered the location of it from. Right, so it is. So the southeast. It, it, Basically, it's saying it's somewhere. I think it's here. Yeah, it's here. So I need to get to there. And the nearest location is over there. Um. So, would it be quicker to just run down there and swim? I think it would. Right, so I'm kind of going over to this location, um, so I need to basically go out of here. Hopefully, should take us to the um, one of the areas of the Nile. Oh. Out of my way! Oh. Halt! Stay Whoa. there, you. Um. Yes, so I am. I think it's because we went on to a bit of land we weren't supposed to. Whoa. Oh, and there is very conveniently a little <coughs> boat there. So that most definitely, without a doubt, saved us having to. Um, Now, I don't think I killed all the um, leopards in this layer. Question is, is it actually in the layer itself? Um, okay, so I think it is. So um, there is a way that it shows that we can get straight into it from a different route. So basically we've got to go up there, which is what I think I actually <coughs> fought some of the actual lepers actually, to be fair. <coughs> Mind you, it wouldn't take long or much for um, other scavenger creatures to um
Okay, well apparently I didn't kill all the um, leopards, so I better expect some form of confrontation in this part. See, this is a bit I don't remember going into, but that's it, that's a papyrus salt. Um, so let's just go back to um, Homeopolis quickly because I'm not particularly fancying the idea of um, So let's just unmark that quickly, um, as we're not. Right, so the next is Wabet Burning Bush Papyrus. Um, now, I'm pretty sure is that over here? No, that's the valley market. Now, where did I? I did see the Wabet one earlier on. Um, So it makes me think of um, Bugs Bunny. Oh, I th think I remember it. Was, uh, I think it was Memphis now, actually. Uh, yeah, it makes me think it was Bugs Bunny when he says... Um, uh, I think, yep, so that's basically that one there. Um... And again, I think that one was one of the easiest ones to find, I think, because it was actually within the temple itself. Um, but hidden just behind some walls. So I think this is going to be probably the last one, I hope, for this one. If not, I will be recording straight after. Um, although I'll have probably have some breakfast first um, before I continue. Right, so in this instance, I think we're going to somewhere just over here that we've not been to. So Where am I again? So I will need to go here and grab a boat. Um, so it's, I think, you know, if I don't make this on time, um, as I say, I'll record the next one straight after, um, which I think then will then complete it and it, or the, all the papyrus solving. If it does, that means that I can, as scheduled, go ahead with doing the first um, one curse of the pharaohs on Saturday. Um, with, although my plan um, is to do uh, more of the ha uh, Harry Potter Lego collection today. I think really and truthfully what I need to do is when I'm planning my things out I actually need to write them down rather than just so um, okay there's a boat there that's just Ooh, I just keep pressing the wrong button to go up just nicking your boat mate Right now, how the hell do I get out of this location? Oh, there we go. Wait a second. I 
I don't exactly know why I'm doing that for. I think I'm just pressing the wrong button. <laughs> I think Senna's just done a, an act for me. I'm not going to try getting it. It's taking a lot longer to get to than I thought. So at least if you see in the, the vague direction that I'm going, the life out of me doing that hippo. Yeah, so you see in a vague um, location that I'm going to. Um, so you press the button, and it is kind of supposed to speed him up, but. I'm So we might be alright, we might just get this one in time. Um, right, actually I think we might be alright because I've got a feeling what I'm looking at directly in front of me is what is where the treasure is. Is it will be good to end on that one rather than what I did the last time and then have to explain to you? Um, there we go, the burning bush. Right, so what I'll do is I'll end the recording here. Uh, look at that beautiful style of view. I might actually just take a photo of that before I restart the next recording. Um, but thank you very much for watching. I hope you liked and enjoyed what you saw. If you did, hit the like and subscribe button and hit the notification bell for the next time I um, upload a new video. And have a good day.